Вітаю, пані та панове! This is Ukrainian Spirit, and we continue our journey through northern Norway, Lofoten Islands. I'm gonna show you right now, there is a picturesque mountains all around me, and the way up here is really, really beautiful. But the focus of today's video is still our Vojvodka series, uh, drinks from Kiev region, made by Anton Petrov from uh, Russia, actually. He moved to Ukraine in 2014, and he started making those amazing drinks that we are reviewing right now. Today's drink is a Zubrivka or Zubr grass, bison grass. <laughs> it's a really popular Polish drink actually, but uh, I think it has more of a like general Slavic roots. So uh, bison grass is a really, really interesting combination to alcohol and it gives this, you know, almost like lemongrass. So it has this special, tasty, spicy, a flavor which can brighten up any alcohol and especially vodka because vodka usually doesn't smell or doesn't taste like much uh, yeah the smell is sweet is aromatic it think of hay like have you ever tried fresh hay or smelled it it's amazing smell and it smells of a fresh hay of summer or maybe late summer beginning of autumn when it's still warm and everything is so aromatic you know like step half of ukraine is covered with steps and aromats from step grasses step flowers is amazing and this is what i'm smelling in this glass to the taste mm. oh wow it's much better than its Polish counterpart. So Polish Zubrovka is more like vodka with bison grass flavoring. This one is a legitimate liquor or legitimate infusion. It has some sugary essence to it, maybe some kind of sour note. Uh, I really enjoy that it has more body. It's full, it's developed, it really takes me and brings all those summer fl flavors, all this hay and uh, grasses and flowers, and it makes it complete, complete uh, thing. So I'm gonna make sure to review it in the warmth of house right now. It's gotten some interesting note. Uh, it's almost like meat stew, some kind of meaty note, more, more rooty, more darker tone. It doesn't smell sweet, it doesn't smell particularly hay-like, like it was before. And in the taste, now it's uh, even more fruitier, almost like a berry, um, like raspberry, maybe something like that. So it's a little bit sweet, a little bit spicy very fragrant honey it reminds me of honey really really nice drink but actually i think i enjoyed it more outside so and yeah i really i really enjoyed this drink in those beautiful norwegian mountains so cheers to you guys as usual see you again Budma.